Hi guys, welcome back to Irish Fully Vlogs. Welcome back to another match day vlog. We've got the Loud Derby tonight, Strata United's Dundalk. Uh, massive, massive game for both teams. It really is. They obviously met in the Jim Malone Cup and uh, start of the season, Dundalk were edged out of that one 2 1 at Orioles. So they're going to be looking for revenge tonight. Strangely enough, both teams have actually won one match this season, but for Drottler's point of view, they've lost four. Dundalk are actually unbeaten, a lot of draws. So they come into this match, both teams, I suppose Dundalk are in better form. Uh, Drottler are conceding a lot of the goals at the moment. They feel like they'll need to tighten up at the back. Uh, what do you think? Yeah, think, yeah. Who's going to win? I think Drottler, I don't see, uh, I mean, Dundalk, I can't see Drottler uh, winning this stuff. The performances lately, they haven't been that good. No, I suppose, yeah. I suppose they haven't been at their best at all lately. The Dock are a funny one at the moment, though, to be fair. I mean, like, five draws, I don't know, it's solid, but you need to start winning as well. So they want to start winning tonight and get revenge, I suppose, for that game at Oriel in G the Jim Malone Cup. Uh, Darren Markey's there for six weeks. For Drogheda, so he's a loss, but I'm really looking forward to this, guys. I think it's going to be a cracking atmosphere at United Park tonight. Uh, at the moment, the sun is out. Obviously, it's going to be set by then, but uh, I think we're in for... You know, a good night of football, I think, and uh, really looking forward. It's going to be a cracking atmosphere. Drotted are going to bring a great atmosphere to the occasion, as are Dundalk. So, uh, really looking forward to this. You looking forward to it, Billy? Yeah, I think uh, Dundalk are probably going to win like 3 1 or something. Oh, he's gone there. That could come back to bite your arse now. By the time people are watching this, they'll actually know the result. Right, guys, yeah. we'll see you in there. Okay. <laughs>
Sean Rowan. So guys, just parked up, uh, my mate's gone in to get a chipper there, uh, yeah what an atmosphere tonight, shot of the one, Dundalk now, brilliant atmosphere, um, the match itself, first half, I think there wasn't much between the teams, Huben had a good chance to score, should have scored, McCarry cleared one off the line for the Drogs, or for Dundalk, it was a Drogs chance, um, second half was a much better game, and the early penalty from Dean Williams made it a much better game I think. Um, it was a penalty, it was a clumsy challenge, I felt it was a penalty. Um, and after that I think Trotter were the better side in the second half. I thought they were a much better side. They sat in at times, was sat in very well. Dundalk didn't really look like scoring if I'm honest. They were very disappointing in the second half, I think in their attempts to try and break down Trotter. They needed more urgency in their play. But Trotter had conceded a lot of goals in the last few weeks and you know they'd be delighted with the way they won the game. They really dug it out. Um, it was something they needed to show and it's a brilliant three points apart from the fact that it's a loud derby it's a brilliant three points for a start for them and they'd be delighted with that I thought they looked like more likely to score a second than Dundalk were to get an equaliser Adam Foley I thought was excellent on the night and uh, he hit one that rattled across very another chance just wide he really probably his best game for Drottled actually since he came back and um, as I said they ran out winners and fully deserved to win the game to be honest which is much the better side in that second half. Uh, Dundalk will be a bit worried about that, the fact that they really struggled to break down Drogheda, to be honest with you. Um, I expected a kitchen sink type thing in the last 10 minutes, never really came. Um, but it was a great atmosphere, a great derby, and uh, obviously a fantastic three points for Drogheda, a disappointing night for Dundalk. What should the people do, Billy? Uh, like and subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell notification button. Good man. See you later, guys. Thanks for watching.